Hello, it's me Soaring Moon here with a different kind of video for you today. Recently, I was invited to the creator program for a newly released game you have probably already heard of, which would be Once Human. As part of that creator's program, I will be streaming the game live on both YouTube and Twitch over the opening week, for as long as is physically possible for me. Before the release though, I would like to provide some information about the game's launch which will be useful to you. Should you be jumping into the game on opening day like me? The first and foremost information I would like to provide is that Once Human is a free-to-play game. Most people are hopping into the Once Human Discord server asking how much the launch price is, not knowing that Once Human is a free-to-play survival massively multiplayer game. As a free-to-play game, it comes with certain expectations about how the game is going to be monetized. According to the development team that has remained consistent on the matter, unlike with the recently released Terraland which went pay to win just before launch, Once Human is said to have no pay to win elements of any kind. With microtransactions being cosmetic items and base customization options very similar to Fallout 76, whose monetization structure I actually like. Just as a heads up there is a gotcha machine in Once Human. However, it is important to note that the currency used for this machine can only be acquired in-game and cannot be purchased. Many people left the game during the beta, thinking that this was a gotcha loot box mechanic. It is in the game to kind of both make fun of that monetization technique, as well as utilize it to distribute ring loot. The release times will be as follows for each region worldwide. Once Human will be releasing in every region simultaneously, at approximately 5 p.m. Eastern tomorrow on the 9th of July, which is 2 p.m. for the west coast of the U.S., 10 p.m. for the U.K., and 6 and 7 in the morning for the Japanese and Australian players. Again, this is a free-to-play game with monetization and a cash shop that sells cosmetic items. The Once Human team has said that NetEase will have to drop them before they add pay-to-win items to the microtransaction store. We will see how that claim holds up with time, or if they supply pay-to-win-like options, such as pay for convenience. Lastly, again, I will be streaming on both Twitch and YouTube during the launch week. Twitch drops have already been announced. For one watch hour you get a nice little thumbs up weapon charm. At two watch hours a pair of boots. At four hours you get a cap, pants at six watch hours. Finally at eight watch hours, you get the top that has been shown in the promotional material. Anyhow, that is it for this video. If you wouldn't mind liking and subscribing to the channel for new content, especially related to Once Human, that would be great. I would also appreciate you sharing this video with others and following on Twitch. Alright, thank you for watching. Okay, thanks, bye.